Hello, welcome to So Much to Talk About Big East Media Day. My pleasure to have um, the one of the top players in the history of the Big East Conference, that's for sure. Uh, forward center for the Notre Dame Fighting Irish, Luke Hamragody. Pleasure to have you on once again. Nice to be here today. Good to see you. Yes, indeed. Good to see you. And uh, talk about how special it can be to be able to have be able to have be the career leader in points and rebounds for this historic conference. Very special to me, and you know that's one of the things you know this year that you know I, people are looking at me for. You know, to accomplish and set those records, but I still think as a team, you know, there's a lot of goals that we still need to accomplish as well. Right, right. And you had a disappointing year last year of not making the NCAAs, but I know this year you guys will be back for sure. And then talk about what are the things I know. Um, Coach Bray talked about that you and Tori have a chip on your shoulder being the seniors. Tori and myself, we look at it as you know, it's our last go around, so you know, we have to make it back. I mean, there's no other. There's no other way out of it, and uh, we do have the chip on our shoulder, after, especially after last season. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, what, and how uh, how did you work on your game over the summer, your post game, and things like that? Because I know you you will be uh, looked at in the next level. So talk about like uh, things you worked on to pr prepare for the NBA. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely a lot of things you need to, to do to pre prepare yourself for the next level. But uh, you know, I'm definitely gonna stick with my bread and butter this year, going inside. But I still think. Uh, you know, there's some things I can do on the perimeter, a lot of different things that people might see this year. Mm -hmm. And I, know, I noticed that you, your, your game, your 15-foot game, definitely got better for sure. So um, so the thing, so I know this summer you worked on shooting more jump shots, mm -hmm. like 18-footers, 20-footers, things like Yeah, just a lot of footwork on the, you know, the perimeter, you know, getting out there, getting a lot more shots up and, you know, just position and stuff like that. Wow, and uh, in the history of Notre Dame, I know um, you guys could have the most wins ever, you know, like uh, the Kelly Tabruka teams, you know, from 70, mm -hmm. I think 74 to 78, you know, so talk about like um, that tradition, the Notre Dame tradition, and how that, you know, leaving your mark and leaving your legacy, how special it would be. You know, that would be great. I mean, that would be a huge accomplishment. You know, I might look to the breaking those records as this being, like, you know, a bigger goal for us. Mm -hmm. I mean, it would be great to leave the University of Notre Dame as that and leave a mark in the basketball program. Wow. Well, how do you want to be remembered in Notre Dame? I think uh, for this, you know, for me to be remembered as one of the all-time Notre Dame greats this year, I need to lead the team, you know, back to the NCAA tournament because you know, I feel as a player, you know, with this team, you know, if you can't lead a team, then, you know, it's, you're just not going to, you know, go out in a way you should go out and should be remembered. Right. Leadership, that is the key. Absolutely. Lead yes, by example. Yeah, it is. <laughs> So, Luke, thank you so much for taking All time right. out. Once again, good All luck. Right, nice and to see you. I'll be seeing, seeing right. um, Monster 2020 games from you, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully we will. Right. <laughs> Take care. That sounds good.